This is SAT test six, non-calculator question number one. College Board gives us a paragraph providing the context for a linear equation, t equals 15n plus 12, and then asks, what does the 12 represent in this equation? College Board will often give you a linear equation in context and that, then ask for the meaning of either the slope or the intercept. In this case, the slope is 15, the intercept is 12, so they're asking for the meaning of the intercept in context. In this context, T is the total price, total amount paid in dollars for N tickets. N is the number of tickets, and they're asking what does the 12 represent? What does the intercept represent? The 15 represents the amount the price goes up for each increase by one in the number of tickets. So the price of one ticket in dollars, that would be 15. That's the slope. The amount of the service fee in dollars. That sounds correct, but let's check the other answers. The total amount in dollars Salim will pay for one ticket. If n equals 1, Salim pays 15 times 1 plus 12 is 27. That is not 12. And the total amount in dollars Salim will pay for any number of tickets. Again, since that's not correct for n equals 1, that's not correct for any number. So. The 12 is the service fee in dollars. The correct choice here would be B. College Board will ask this typically a couple times on each SAT where they're asking for either the slope or the intercept or both in context. Come back soon for my next math video. With math, there's always more.